Someone's at the front door. All right, let's go and open up the box for the first time because I don't even know what's up in here. All right. Yo, what the f Yo, what's good, y'all? So, trailer, shout out to TCO, man, because they really hooking your boy up today with some TCO 20 Pro Media Kit stuff. I worked with them last year on the TCO 10 5G, and now we got the TCO 20 5G. Let's go. I can't wait to get up inside this. I'm going to retract that comment. This is a PG-13 channel, but all right. Anyway, we got this whole pamphlet right here that says TCO 20 Pro 5G, open up to evaluate your vision. All right, cool, whatever. This is one of the only things I care about, all right? They sent me a whole backpack. Like, come on, bro. Like, you can't beat this. This is like a nice quality backpack. Let me just, oh, wait, hold on. Is that hand sanitizer? They gave me hand sanitizer, y'all. This is something else, man. All right, so I thought this was hand sanitizer, but apparently this is sunblock, and um, I don't think that's gonna do much for me. I think it's safe to say we're good on the sunblock. And they even sent me some chapstick, so I don't know what they trying to tell me right now but look at this backpack man it's even a north face backpack like you can't beat that bro i got like a jordan backpack that i use like every day but i don't know man with this i'm gonna have to reconsider i might be out here repping some tcl merch on the streets like y'all don't even know but we do got the tcl mask right here that's pretty dope another mask that i use right now is a verizon mask and i think i even use another mask i forgot what it's called right now oh yeah it was a louis v supreme mask but honestly i don't even know what i did with it ever since they dropped the whole covid restrictions thing but we got this evaluate your vision tcl 20 pro 5g booklet here which honestly i ain't trying to read through so i'm throwing that to the side for now and that's pretty much it here in this pocket so so I think the phone and stuff is going to be inside the actual bag. So we got to actually find it here. Oh, snap. Look at that. It has two zippers here. And there's the actual stuff. Oh, snap. They really hooked me up. So we got a ProTech Accessorized TTL 20 Pro 5G case here, which is pretty dope. So I'm looking forward to that. We got some insect repellent. Wasn't expecting that. And then we got some more sunscreen like TCL, bro. I know y'all know I'm black, bro. Like I can't do nothing with this, but appreciate it anyway. And then we got not sure what this is right now. I talked to ntftw and this is not a stapler so i'm gonna have to ask him inside this box we got an executive power bank oh snap we talking some serious business then so they actually sent me a whole power bank here that's dope shout out to you for the 8000 million power portable battery here so it's kind of like that new apple battery case you know that one garbage one that's why they got these suction cups here because you can put it on the back of your tcl 25g so i don't know how often i'm gonna use that but we'll see and let me make this clear here you're not gonna get this in your retail unboxing okay like that would be the dopest unboxing ever but no you don't get that unfortunately you just get this and then we got the actual tcl 20 pro 5g so if you want to go ahead and get to the unboxing just go and skip through this through the timestamps i got in the video i'm gonna just go and finish through this but let's see what else we got we got a whole flashlight bro a tcl flashlight let's go and turn this thing on real quick i don't think the batteries are in here right now Nice and bright flashlight right here with different strobe effects, so that's dope. And then finishing up, we got the legendary TCL water bottle Bluetooth speaker. That's the weirdest combination I've ever seen. But taking this out of here real quick, we'll go ahead and pair it to the TCL 25G later. We'll get into that, but not right now. As you can see there, we got a power button and all that stuff. And TCL, I really appreciate you, dog. But just to be honest with you, I'm going to keep it real. I have, like, doubts that this is going to actually replace my hydro flask right here. But I'll go and try this out anyway, because this actually does look pretty dope. So now it's time to unbox what y'all actually came for so tco major shout out to y'all that was the dopest media kit that i've ever received of course that media kit ain't gonna change my opinion about this phone but we'll see about what's up with this phone anyway so we got the actual tco 20 pro 5g right here as you can see so it looks like a nice clean box but that's what you get in the front at the top you got display greatness and on the left and back and the bottom and all that stuff is just tco 20 pro 5g basically interestingly enough though there ain't no specs or anything inside this box here but you know what we gotta do Let's get into this. Let's go and cut our TCL tape here, which I'm just now noticing, so nice touch there. And let's go and get up into the box here. So here is our TCL 20 Pro 5G. Man, look at that color. Oh, I wanted this color so bad, bro. Let's take this out real quick. Woo! Man, look at that blue. That blue is hitting, boy. Man, that look clean. Y'all, I'm not even over-exaggerating. I ain't doing this because they sent me free stuff. This is the dopest looking phone I've seen in a minute. I mean, just look how clean that looks on the front there. Like, man, that looks clean. So shout out to you, TCO. Let's keep going inside the box here. So let's just go ahead and see. Here we have another case, even though they sent me one for the media kit but for people buying the tcl 20 pro 5g you still get a case which is actually pretty nice 
so shout out to them for that it's just a regular tpu case i'm not sure about yellowing over time but we'll have to see about that too over my long-term review anyway we got the actual power brick so let's go and see what the watts are on here so it says 12 volts and 1.5 amps so if you go and times that together we got an 18 watt charger so that's actually pretty decent for this phone now if we keep going up inside of here we can actually see that we got a usb a to usb c cord honestly it's not the biggest deal in the world but i would have liked to see usb c to usb c because as you can see here we got usb a to usb c and some of these newer phones actually got usb c to usb c so like i said it's not the biggest deal in the world but i would have liked to see that and then if you go and look inside of here we did have the user manual and stuff but you know we do with that we throw it to the side and then we got our sim card removal tool all right now back to the phone which i'm gonna have to clearly get a screen protector for because as you can see there's no plastic screen protector on here as you can see here we're already getting fingerprints and i already knew how this is gonna go down but i still prefer this design like man this looks clean but as you can see here we got a four camera setup we got a flash here and then we got the tco logo zooming in here a little bit you can actually see the camera spec so we actually got a 48 megapixel ois camera with a variable aperture rate and all the other technical details right there looking here at the top we can actually see that we got a hole punch and then we got a slit here for our earpiece we can actually see that the screen's a little bit curved here which is actually my favorite design so i don't really care for flat screens this is the way on the right side you can actually see that we got our volume marker and our power button at the bottom you can actually see that we got our sim and micro sd card slot and then we also got a usb c port a microphone and then we got our speakers on the left side honestly don't know what that is yet we're gonna have to go ahead and see when we turn on the phone and at the top we actually got a headphone jack so man how often do you see that in these phones these days and then you got an ir blaster again how often do you see this so at this point all we gotta do is just turn on this phone and then we got the actual tcl logo here as you can see i'm gonna go ahead and let this phone boot up here and then i'll get back to y'all all right so we got the actual tcl 20 pro 5g here and as you can see we got this thing all set up it's not much bezel here it's a little bit but it's nothing too crazy and then you can see what the actual hole punch here looks like with the screen on so i'm gonna go and fast forward through the setup and then i'll get back to y'all Every single time I do a video these days, really. Why Rapids Amber Alert? Bruh. And you know what? I'm just going through the setup. You can't get past. Okay, now just stop. All right, y'all. So now we're all done with the setup here. So as you can see, wait, let me hit agree and nope i guess we weren't done to set up now we are man look at that wallpaper i don't know why but this wallpaper just don't belong in this phone but let me just stop talking about this anyway the tcl 20 pro 5g i got this thing all set up here and man my first impressions besides that amber alert this phone is a really slick phone man it's really nice but man look at those fingerprints you're definitely gonna need a case or even a skin or something you know when they gave me this tcl cleaning cloth here i think they were trying to tell me something so yeah i could kind of see why they gave this to me now anyway y'all as far as i know this isn't a verizon exclusive device which is really good news so i'm really glad tcl didn't go that route like they did last year as you can see but man huge difference here as you can see with the tcl 10 5g here and then you got the tcl 20 pro 5g so this just looks way nicer than the tcl 10 5g yeah this thing may pick up a lot of fingerprints and probably even way more than even the tcl 10 5g but bro you just can't get over that design right there even in front of the screen i'm really feeling a lot more on the tcl 20 pro 5g now to be fair this tcl 20 pro 5g does actually cost 500 dollars. this did not cost 500 dollars, so we're gonna have to go and see if this thing is worth it or not but to keep it real with y'all this phone is something that i'm really really hyped to go ahead and try especially like way more than the tcl 10 5g last year so now all we gotta do at this point is just go and try out one more thing and that is the water bottle speaker not sure if we have battery life in this thing but let's go ahead and try it out here let's just go ahead and press this power button and i think we had to my had to hold on to it not sure there we go so now let's go and grab our tcl 20 pro 5g and let's go ahead and pair this speaker real quick honestly i'm not sure if tcl is selling this separately you almost dropped that but i don't think they are all right so we got the sound wave bottle right here let's go ahead and pair this thing up and let's give it a minute let, well, let me go ahead and hit on that real quick and there we go now we're connected you know that's the same sound i heard from those cheap family dollar speakers i know i'm criticizing tcl a lot right now especially because they send me free stuff but i'm just keeping it real with y'all all right let's go and play a youtube video and let's go ahead and hear how this thing sounds i mean 
it's not the the best speaker I've ever heard, but it's not the worst speaker I've ever heard. Like this is a pretty small speaker. Keep this in mind. This isn't the whole water bottle. This is only the top that's playing the music, and this is actually not that bad. Now I'm not sure if I ever told myself like, man, you know what I would really want in my life is a water bottle with a speaker on it. Like that that just never came up. So I think for now we're gonna stick with our UE Mega Boom Three. But honestly, this isn't a bad idea. This is actually pretty cool. Maybe I bring this thing to CES 2022 because I am going next year and play this thing on the Vegas Strip in Fremont. I don't know, playing Pooh Shiesty. But let's actually check out one more thing, this accessorized case right here. I know this video is getting lengthy, but I mean, it is what it is. We have timestamps for a reason these days on YouTube. So this is our accessorized case here that TCL sent me with the TCL 20 Pro 5G. Let's go ahead and slap the 20 Pro 5G in there and there we go man this is a pretty rugged case like it feels nice and even the buttons like wow those are some clicky buttons right there pretty tactile so that's nice i'll probably just get into this more later but thanks for watching y'all if you liked this video go ahead and give this video a like and if you really liked it go and subscribe but go and follow me on my social media at Centec on instagram and twitter and facebook but instagram and twitter so i'm most active if i didn't make it clear i really appreciate y'all i know i criticize some things but that's just because you know i'm trying to be honest here but really i I am hyped for this TCL 20 Pro 5G right here, even though I am a little bit late because I did hit him up late. So now I'm finally unboxing the TCL 20 Pro 5G media kit like every other YouTuber out there. But thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. And ha!